Hey everyone, welcome to Cricut Time. If you like this video, subscribe for more project ideas and tutorials on all things Cricut. Hey everyone, instead of paying for a banner in Cricut Design Space, I'll show you how you can make your own in under five minutes. So let's get started by going over to shapes and grabbing a square. Just click on the width and let's change it to four inches wide. Now just unlock it and let's make it a little bit longer so that it's a rectangle. Go to your shapes and add in a triangle and flip it vertically. Let's unlock your triangle and just adjust it here so that it's wider than the rectangle and let's make it a bit shorter so that it's not such a long point. Lay your triangle on top of your rectangle and you want to have a little bit of corners sticking out on each side. Highlight all the shapes and then down at the bottom here we're going to click slice. What we're trying to do is take off those parts that are sticking out. Now just click on one of the shapes that have the little triangle sticking out and then down at the bottom right click on contour. We're just gonna click on those little triangles that we wanna remove. And go back and click on the rest of these little triangles. Let's go click on contour again. And we'll take them out. Now, as you can see, all the little triangles are gone that are sticking out, but my shape is split up into three different parts. So what we're gonna do is highlight all of them. And then down at the bottom, click weld. Now we have our general shape for our banner but let's add in a couple holes so that we can put the string through. On shapes, just drag over a circle. I'll just make it a different color here so it's easier to see. And let's resize it so it's a small little hole for the corner. Once you're happy with the size, duplicate it and just drag one over to the other side. Now right now I have three different layers over on the right hand side and I wanna put it down into one. So clicking on your banner and one of the circles Highlight both of them and then click on slice. And then you can just go through and delete your little circles there. The other circle isn't gone. It's just been moved below my banner. So we're just gonna click on the banner and the other circle. Click on slice again. So we'll just click on both of the holes on the right. And I'll just delete both of those. And there we have it, my banner shape is ready. I'm going to make my banner say last day for last day of school. So I'll just need seven of these. And then let's just highlight all of them and change the color so that it's easier to see our writing. So I'll show you a trick for making your writing so that it's all the same size. Just click on text and put in a letter and then pick your font and change your size so that you're happy with it. Once you have it how you like it, just click on your letter, copy it, and then paste so that you have a letter for each banner. Now you just have to go through and change the letters into what you want them to be. I like doing it this way because I don't have to mess around with sizing on each one. Just go through and fine tune and make sure you're happy with the placement of the letters and then you are ready to make it. Well, thanks for joining me today. If you liked this video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more project ideas and tutorials on all things Cricut.